At the start of the first EVA, EV1 comes out of the airlock and retrieves a bag and puts it on the BRT, my body restraint tether, followed by EV2. EV1 translates up to the truss, out to the port side, onto P1 to drop off the anchor points for the safety tethers. EV2 takes a bag and puts it on the articulating portable foot restraint. EV1 continues translating further outboard onto the crew and equipment translation aid, followed by EV2, who translates up onto the truss and continues further out onto the P6 truss. EV2 will drop off the foot restraint, and EV1 will attach a bag to a foot restraint and continue translating outboard. EV1 will drop off the foot restraint, remove the bag, and relocate it to the exposed pallet. EV2 will remove a bag and stow it at the integrated equipment assembly. Both crew members will install what are called gap spanners, which allow them to translate on the integrated equipment assembly. EV2 will relocate a pistol grip tool for future use. The crew members install what we call scoops, which are handling aids for the batteries. EV2 ingresses the foot restraint, and the two crew members remove the first of the nickel hydrogen batteries, the old batteries. The two crew members shepherd the battery between the two of them from the IEA over to the exposed pallet. EV1 ingresses the foot restraint and the two crew members stow the old battery onto the exposed pallet. EV1 removes the scoops and the station arm operator relocates the exposed pallet to position the new lithium ion battery in front of EV1. EV1 installs the scoops and releases the new lithium ion battery. EV1 hands the battery to EV2 and the two crew members shepherd the new battery out to the integrated equipment assembly. EV2 ingresses the foot restraint, and EV1 hands the new battery over. The two crew members install the lithium ion battery onto the integrated equipment assembly, and remove the scoops. EV2 relocates the foot restraint. They prepare to remove the next old battery. EV2 removes the battery, hands it over to EV1, and the two crew members shepherd the old battery back to the exposed pallet. EV1 ingresses the foot restraint, while EV2 hands the old battery over, and it's stowed on the body restraint tether. The two crew members release the adapter plate, and EV2 stows that on the BRT. EV2 translates out to the integrated equipment assembly while EV1 stows the old battery on the exposed pallet. EV1 joins EV2 and the two crew members install the adapter plate. EV2 attaches the cable between the adapter plate and the lithium ion battery, and that completes the circuit. V1 retrieves the bag, while EV2 retrieves the pistol grip tool, and the two crew members translate back to the airlock to complete the first EVA. EV2 ingresses first, followed by EV1.